Evacuees from Mariupol's Azovstal plants were expected to arrive in the Ukrainian city of Zaporizhia on Monday. Eyewitness video showed civilians emerging from the factory's rubble on Sunday and led to waiting coaches. The United Nations and International Committee of the Red Cross began an operation on April 29th to bring women, children and the elderly from the steelworks. Azovstal has been a holdout for hundreds of Ukrainian troops and civilians after Russia's incursion into Mariupol. Some evacuees who had not been holed up in Azovstal arrived in Zaporizhia Monday independently from the UN operation. Natalia was one of those evacuees. She said she had left Mariupol some time ago and had been hiding in a basement in a nearby village. We lived in the basement starting from the 27th of February. We didn't leave because our house is so close to Azovstal. The whole time we were shelled with mines and then the airstrike started. Our house is completely destroyed. We had a two-story building and it's not there anymore. Russia has focused on Ukraine's south and east after it failed to capture Kyiv in the early weeks of the conflict. Thousands of civilians have died and five million have fled the country.